Yo, what's up, guys? It's Nick from Big Ends Gaming. Welcome back to another MLB The Show 22 Diamond Dice videos today. Huge content update, a lot to go over. I mean, if you're wondering why I have 700k, it's because I just cashed in my roster update investments. Uh, so, yeah, we have so much content to go over. I can't go over all of it. So, I'm gonna go to the feature program. It's Legends of the Franchise. We have, it's basically Faces of the Franchise, but with Legends, and they're all juiced. So I'm just going to go through all of them really quickly. I'm not going to stop. You can pause the video if you want to see the attributes and really look at it. Oh god, please don't be slow servers. But here's Brooks Robinson, Cy Young, Jorge Posada. This is the best catcher in the game in my opinion. Wade Boggs, nice contact. Sean Green, really, really good against righties. In the AL Central, we got Cliff Lee, his control. I mean, that's just ridiculous. His par is going to be tiny. Ray Durham, switch hitter. Al Trammell, uh, Brett Saberhagen, probably the worst one. Torrey Hunter, we've never really had a really good Torrey Hunter card, so that's nice to see. AL West, Roy Oswalt, four seam sinker, 12 six slider changeup, nice pitch mix, nice per nine, same, literally the same thing that Jared Weaver, except he throws a little slower. Yeah. Ricky Henderson, you know, I, I wish the power was a little higher, especially against righties, but this is a very good card. Edgar Martinez, this is another really good card and Pudge, so Ivan Pudge Rodriguez, you know, max contact. And the thing about these cards is they have crazy defensive flexibility, and I'm saying like secondary positions. For example, if we go back to Jorge Posada, they gave him second base. He literally played one game at second base in his whole career. <laughs> so if you see all these crazy secondaries, that's, that's why They're, they just decided to do it. Hank Aaron, by far, not even close, the best card out of all 30 of them I mean he plays literally everywhere except short and catcher and he's an elite hitter end game this is an end game card like this is gonna most likely be on my final team AJ Burnett really really good with the per nines Tom Glavin really really good with the control pretty much the same thing as uh, Cliff Lee Mike Schmidt can play the entire infield with diamond defense really good hitter Andre Dawson this is the closest that we've gotten to that MLB The Show 17, Andre Dawson. Those of you OGs who played that game, the Nationals team epic, Andre Dawson, literally like one of the best cards in MLB The Show history. Maybe he plays like that card, hopefully he does. NL Central, Ryan Sandberg, you know, high contact, pretty solid power. Joe Morgan, uh, not amazing power, but you know, I mean, every card does something end game well. And for him, it's like speed and contact. Prince Fielder, Insane first baseman bat. Jason Bay, all around balanced, really good bat. And then Ozzy Smith. Ozzy Smith actually has 99 power versus lefties. I mean, this card can literally do everything except hit homers against righties. So, yeah. NL West, we got Steve Finley. I'm so happy that he got one of these cards because his swing is butter and he has really good stats. Like, that power is amazing. Contact. It gets the job done, it's over 100, and he has diamond defense with good speed. He might honestly make my team. His swing is so good. Todd Helton, uh, more of a contact guy, but he does have some pop. Don Sutton, the pitch mix is kind of, and the velocity is kind of holding him back. But it's still 117 hits per nine. Tony Gwynn, max out contact. He's going to get a bunch of singles for you and really good speed, good defense. Not amazing power. And then Willie McCovey, it's basically just another Prince Fielder, but a little worse fielding. So, yeah. Those are the 30 new cards. There are no henchmen. Go to the program. It is for three weeks. You got daily moments, yada, yada, yada. Events, each event win is 2,500 XP. You got moments, 30 of them for 30 th for 3,000 a pop. So that's 90K XP just from doing the moments. You got parallels, collections. I already did these, but I saved Clemente, so let me just do that. Or also, yeah, I didn't make a video. Here's the Retro Finest Clemente from yesterday. Go get him. It's an easy program. Uh, yeah, we got exchanges as always. I don't even think I'm going to need them because of how much stuff you can do. And then Conquest for 40k XP. There's probably going to be two more. Uh, is there anything? Oh, yeah, there's new tops now. I'll just run through them real fast. We got Hunter Brown. Randall Gritchick, Oscar Gonzalez, and then the collection is Yohan Moncada. I'll show him. Yohan Moncada. There you go. 
Now let's quickly go through the roster update. Roster update. Okay, roster update. You know, there is a lot. I'm not going to go through all this. I'm just going to scroll through it all. You can pause, yada, 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 or you can just go into the game and check it out yourself. I'm going to focus on the guys who are getting close to Diamond or went Diamond. For example, uh, where is he? Zach Gallen. I sold, I sold him early because he was at around 4K and he's an 86, so that was the right decision. He's, a, he's one of the new Diamonds. We also have, who else went Diamond? Lindor, I don't understand how he went diamond, but I mean, good for him. Uh, Edmund went back to diamond. We got who else? Real Muto went diamond, and then Darvish went diamond. That was a shock to me that he got a plus three. And Julio Urias, I invested in. He was literally quick sell value like three days ago. I don't know how he was so cheap, but he went diamond, and then I think that was it, right? Yeah. Nate Lowe. Is an 84. Vlad is a gold. Javier is an 84. Felix Bautista, I invested in him. Quick sell for 900. Now he's an 84, and he's on Diamond Watch. Uh, Andres Munoz, 84. Christian Walker, 84. Evan Phillips, still at 84. He didn't make it. I invested in him, but he didn't make it. Uh, I guess we could go to Silvers to Golds, which I actually haven't seen yet. Oh my. What the. F Plus six, Jake McCarthy with a plus six. That is unbelievable. <laughs> you got a plus six. All right. Uh, yeah, let me go through the new diamonds, Trevelyan downgrades. Uh, or new, not new diamonds, new golds. We got Lance Lynn. Okay. And then who else do we got? Framber Valdez obviously was going to go gold. We got Jesus Luzardo is a new gold. Tyler O'Neill is heating up, apparently, if he's going gold. Dalton Dal Varsho's back. Out of Vino's a gold. Uh, Yon y Jonathan Daza. Who else? We got Albert Pujols is a gold. Good friend. Eloy's a gold. Alexis Diaz. Saw that coming. Peter Fairbanks, plus eight. Oh, my God. All right. Uh, what else we got? Boba Shett. Yeah, that makes sense. Randy's a gold, Arise is a gold, Joe Ryan, and yeah, so th those are the tier jumps. But now for the collection, and the big collection is Jimmy Rollins, 99 overall. This is a very good shortstop card. He literally does everything right. High contact, the power, it made it into the hundreds, so he'll get the job done. Switch hitter, elite defense, literally maxed out speed. This is a very good card. Uh, tops now. There's a 99 Christian Yelich, you know, could be better against lefties, but I mean, it's still a nice card. So I'm just going to unlock it right now on camera. So 33 finest, and I have to do every single one of them because the Legends of the Franchise one, that one is impossible right now because you need 50. So you need 30 of the face, if you, if you have all the face of the franchises, you need 20 of the ones that literally just came out. So. You have to do all of them for now at least. So let me just lock up all the no cells so I save every single stub. Let me do that first. I don't know how many there are. I mean I have literally every single card except for a few. Alright. Let me go with all these. I think I, I, I might honestly have to collect every single one of these. This is really challenging. I'll hold off from Outlighter. I'll go Hayward. Yeah, I'll do all these guys. Oh my god, these, okay, let me set off Aparicio, Lorenzo, yeah, okay, these skyrocketed in price because of how difficult, you know, I'm just going to select all, so I can skip one, two, three, four, so I'm, I, who's really expensive, Ripkins, okay, I want to, I want, okay, yeah, this video is going to be really long, I want to save as many stuffs as I can, so, yeah, uh, Jason Kendall. Okay, so let me take off Ripken. Use Kendall. I want to use Wainwright because he's cheap. Cheaper. Victory. Yeah, so I'll take off one more. I'll take off Aparicio and then I'll do Wainwright and then boom. Alright, so there's Finest. Let's go to Tops now. Just auto. Oh, no. I don't care. Uh, Takashi. 
we need four more. So let's go with Soriano. Let's go with Feller. And then, okay, Damon. And then them two are more expensive than Maddox. So let me go with Maddox. There's Takashi. Milestone. We need five more. Let's go with these henchmen. Okay, let me go with... Alright, which one? I'm going to be locking in some expensive players. So I got those two. Vital Blue. Yeah, these cards went up. Oh my god. Okay, well I'm going to be locking in. They're all a map. They're pretty much the same except for Nolan Ryan. So I'll just do... Yeah, I'll just do them too. So, there we go. There's Milestone. What? I mean, Signature. We need five more. One, two, three... Four, five. Let's. Or I want to do the headliner instead of, yeah, instead of a boss. So there is signature. Let's go to awards. I literally have every single one of them. So let me just do the cheaper ones. Are there any no sells? I don't think I. Yeah, they're all sellable. So let me do. Keith is. Yeah, he's cheap. Palmer, Reggie. I'll hold off for now. More no, yeah, more no is cheap, and then okay, I'll probably end up going with Reggie. Uh, yeah, let me go with Reggie. Oh, I need two more. Okay, so I'll just do them two. There's awards. Prime, we need 27. Let's go with Ryan Howard, Turner. Okay, and then I don't know which one. Okay, that's cheap. That's cheaper. And then let's go Springer and Euclid because these two are really expensive. So boom, there's Prime. Face of the franchise, like I said, I mean, I'll just lock these guys in just to do it, but can't do that right now. Prospect, literally need, just need one more. Just do that. Let's go to, I don't know, I'm skipping that. Future Stars, we need 50, so let me lock in these cheap ones. All right, that's an event reward. And I'll skip him for now. Let's go down here. And let's do these toolbox ones. Yeah, one, two, three. He's okay. Hassle. I'll do him. And then two. I'm just I'm just penny pinching. Like that's pretty much it. Boom. All right. Future stars. That's why I'm not just selecting all because I'm penny pinching. All right. For this, let me just do the no cells. Okay. No cell. No cell. No cell. I mean, actually, these are all no cells except for the henchmen from other programs. So yeah. Go. there's monthly awards second half I have all but one of them so okay let me lock in that's a no let's do these probably okay are there any that are cheap or like relative okay there's one Duke Snyder was a is not sellable let me do him Vlad is more okay no sell Mickey Mantle and then boom there we go second half Let's go to rookie. I, I, I mean, I, I, I honestly, I, I, I can just auto sell here. Let me get all these bronzes and silvers, and then see if there are any that I need to still do. And if there is, I, I'll just pick the no cells because I mean these are all just BR rewards. So yeah, I mean, are there any no cells down here? No, there aren't. Yeah, so I'll just lock those in. Breakout. Let's do the same thing here. Let me just auto select and check for any no cells. Uh, oh, okay. I'm actually gonna have to. Yeah, let me. 50 kit. God damn. All right. Uh, yeah, I'll do that. I mean, uh, I'm almost short on breakouts, which is incredible. All star. I'll do the same. Are there any no cells down here? I'm just penny pinching, guys. Like I know this video. Damn, we're already 14 minutes. Uh, I don't see any no cells, so I'll just lock them in. All-star. Postseason. Oh wait, veteran. I missed. Let me just. Yeah. I mean, I just needed two more. Veteran is done, and then postseason. Let me just do the same thing here. Right. I don't have any non-sellables, so boom. There we go. Postseason. Let's go to Jimmy Rollins, and Jimmy Rollins has been acquired. If you guys want to know how I got him, literally right when he came out, just sub to me on YouTube. You know, you're watching the video right now, or on TikTok, Big Ends Gaming. I have investment tips, all that stuff. So, yeah. That's pretty much it for this video. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. I've been your host, Nick, from Big Ends Gaming. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.